What hey, up, everybody? everybody? Ain't no reason to get excited. We're watching Letter Kenny. The episode's called Ain't No Reason to Get Excited. Season one, episode one. This is a reaction request, guys. Yeah. Doesn't mean we're continuing it, but we're gonna see how it is to put up on our polls later. See what the response is to you guys. I heard this is a really funny show. It's a Canadian comedy sitcom. Yeah. Canadian is it's like America's hat, so we're very excited to see what the hat's going on. Oh my exactly. god. America is the wife beater of the Americas. <laughs> and Mexico is the cut off jorts. Jorts? Jorts. Nice. <laughs> the jorts? The jorts. The jean, the jean shorts? But the cut off jean shorts that you made on your own when ah. it was too hot outside. Yeah, 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 yeah. The old Reno 911 yep. looking jean short boys, yeah. This this was requested to us by a fellow OG Normie supporter, Lauren Shodine. Shodine. Big shout out to Lauren. Shodine. She's Shodine. over there. Shodine. <laughs> She's living in America's hat as well. She uh, is. <laughs> Do you think Canada looks at themselves not as America's hat, but like oh, America maybe. is Canada's shirt? Ooh, or maybe America is Canada's pants. Oh my God. Ooh. What does that mean? Mexico. <laughs> Boots. Ooh. Boots. <laughs> right, yeah. Boots and cats. And boots and cats. Well, there we go. No one actually knows anything about the Americas <coughs> or how we're all stacked up together. We just know that we're over here and we're doing our thing. Hi. And also, we know that this isn't a market substitute. Obviously, go over to Hulu and support Letter Candy on your own. I hear they're Canadian and hilarious, like uh, Jim Carrey. <laughs> so, there you go. Uh, Is Jim Carrey Canadian? Yeah. What? Also, uh, if you thing. want to, you can support the normies over on Patreon. Supporting us on Patreon allows you to be in the highest tier if you want and suggest for us to watch things. This is what's happening currently right now. Yep. But also, supporting us on Patreon means you get to watch ahead, see uncuts, get some early access, and uh, help support our creative endeavors. And you Thank get you the guys. behind the scenes of those of those creative endeavors, which can be really fun. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of our behind the scenes and bloopers for our skits are in the vault. Bloops. Bloops. On the Patreon dish. Bloops on dick, baby. <laughs> Bloops on deck. I don't know. So the, the description for the show says there are jocks, skids, and cool kids. What are skids? No idea. Skids That's are like turd, turds. turds. And what are yeah. turd, turd people. Shit people. What are hicks? Oh, God. What? What was the one? Remember in uh, Misfits? What was the word they were using in Misfits? Chaps. I've That's a real chav. Chav. Really chav. Chav. Boy, I'm a deep thinker. Well. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> oh, you're a deep thinker too. Right? So, uh. Are you hearing this? What do you think about Did Francesca? You hear that? What? You didn't hear that? <laughs> what? So the answer is no, you didn't. We got disconnected. I know, but like for oh, mine, what? Surge's voice just like rattled like at a thousand RPMs. Oh. He went, bam. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, I didn't Whoa. hear that. I did not hear that. I was actually making those sounds. Oh, yeah, sure. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Let's start this. Ready World Cock Time. I have no idea what to Couple expect. A couple hockey players come up the produce stand the other day. <laughs> hey! I like this. Thanks. How are you now? Good, and you? Not so bad. Okay. <laughs> I just wanted to you come in men. Well, I think you come in men enough for all of us. I think you better come in men. Like, you better come up. I think you better come say that to his face, you fucking hicks. Nice execution. You're doing terrific. Hey, I heard about your breakup, buddy. First cheat on you, buddy. That's a real kick in the knackers, bro. Just a real ouchie, bro. You guys <laughs> touch not fight anymore, buddy. Because that's a fight on sight for you and your new guy, buddy. <laughs> Maybe if you've ever been in a real fight, you might not be so keen for another. What'd you say? Tired <laughs> off, boys. You looking for a tilly, buddy? Put down the toy. Pump the brakes. Take your shirt off. Leave your sunglasses on. What sort of backwards fucking pageantry is that? Look at that fucking treasure trail. What's up with your fucking body hair, big shoots? Your aesthetician quaff that for you? <laughs> you can cross fuck off. How many times you pulled your horn today, bud? Ballpark six to eight. You're a fucking animal. Play a little five on one. Get the kitchen, mix a batch. Feed the ducks. Distribute some free literature. Go time! Fucking shut up! Riley, Jonesy, put your fucking shirts on and get out of here. This is it over! Jenks, you owe me a coat. <laughs> It's a hard life picking stones and pulling teeth. Sure as God's got sandals and beats fighting dudes with treasure trails. <laughs> that dude is so funny, you know what I'm talking about at the very end there? Yeah. 
I love the way he's just he like talks. standing perfectly still. This is violently <laughs> Canadian lingo. Talk to Angie yet? Been almost a month now. I think you need to get back on the horse. You know what you need? Sex with a girl. Not with just any girl. A good Christian girl. I think I can help you. I've been going to the Burning Bush Youth Group every Sunday. I think you should come with me. I think you should just eat your yogurt. There's millions of starving kids in the world. Yeah, they ate ten. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? That's gonna be my comeback next time. It's called Tinder. <laughs> Let's see, there's all these girls, and if you don't like one, you just say, nope, move on to the next. But if you do like one, you can see how close they are and, I don't know, maybe meet up. So I like her a lot. Yeah, you just, I don't know, say something like, like, on a scale of one to America, how free are you right now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> 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 Why do you hate them so much? Because hockey players would grab a monkey by the tit if they could. Smoke <laughs> surfer jokes, bud. Play it out for a quick UL, bud. Trap the ass, pal. I hate spitters. Chewing tobacco I hate like spitters. Any shit. How are those like, smokes are for jokes and they're chewing that nasty shit? Tell the fish jokes story, Dan. So, as the story goes, Wayne Hucks and I get a truck with a Confederate flag in the back windshield, and the driver's fume and piss, so we play the scene going full tilt like a Peterbilt, right? <coughs> so <I'm better laughs> what does this mean? I want a beer now. And all Wayne's got on is a pair of cut-off jean shorts. He ain't exactly super jazzed about the situation, was he, Wayne? Oh, hey, cut-off jean shorts. <laughs> <laughs> And he points it out to Wayne and he, he says to Wayne, he says, If I'd known I was going to run into some uptown street toughs today, I'd have done up my top button. <laughs> yeah. That's a real John Wayne motion picture. No, cool hand lives. For near anything, Kevin Costner, really. Either way, I was impressed and I let out an audible gasp. But he hears me, spins around, aims the taser up at me, and lets fire. And if that thing doesn't latch onto my nipple ring, which I'm pretty sure has to the electric current, he sent forces through my entire body. And they just walked over and yanked that thing out of my nipple like it was a goddamn fish hook. At least that's according to my cousin. Well, you know, my second cousin. Who, Garrett? No, Jared. Nobody should admit that. It's poorly clever. Make a wish. Wish you weren't so fucking awkward, bud. This is my new favorite show. Is his hands They're just all like they have to be with Four shots of Gus and Brew, please and thank you. One for you too, Gail. Thank you, Wayne, but I'm off the sauce. Taking eight vitamins a day now. Fish oil, vitamin C, vitamin D, two vitamin B complexes. So how many darts? 2025 darts. Oh, you got her down then. Last I seen you, you were on packing half the smoke. Well, sometimes I would pack an asshole, but never more than two packs of smoke. Uh, <laughs> yeah. All right, well, be rude. Well, I don't this. Oh fuck! I'm about to give birth to a pound of fudge. <laughs> oh no, God! <laughs> That's a skid. Seen Angie with her new dude? What a fucking dandy! Yeah, she's got Fugazi diamonds in both ears and leprechaun buckles on his shoes. He's running a fucking dippity do convention upstairs for a salad. Driving a '94 deep YJ with a wave. What? Is that? You know what? Is that? <laughs> what the fuck, Canada? <laughs> Canadian Hicks part. talk the funniest. You want full Bieber eyes? What? Full Bieber? Bieber eyes. <laughs> Wait. No, man, nobody wants to look at you when you're peeing. Wait. With Wait. Bieber eyes, especially. Wait, just Bieber. Walk for fuck's sake. Just fucking look, Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Bieber, the, the pop star. I'm not familiar with this word. <laughs> <laughs> the most famous Canadian. Uh, Celine Dion. She needs you with her new dude. What a fucking dandy. Eyes on your own work there, Super Chief. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. I hate people who do that. Thank Christ, wait. I'm pushing plot here. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Also, there's one person in the normie office who pees like that. Guess. Chris. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's say we go for a quick ice run, Wayne. Been pushing up on you for years now. Let's say you give old Gaylor one for the scrapbook. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's so drunk, so fucking quick. Yeah, what happened to being off the sauce? It's like immediately. Yes! What is happening? Cops dancing under the fucking techno gals, the cyber cops dancing under the bridge. Bro, actually, this song is dope as fuck. Ah, nice Christian girl. girly. Christy with you. Margaret. 
And you must be Wayne. Mm -hmm. Christ be with you, Wayne. <laughs> oh. You made a good choice coming here tonight. Yeah, why is that? Hold your finger here for as long as you can. What for? Ah. Right. Now imagine your soul engulfed in that for all of eternity. Oh my, oh my god. god. <laughs> Called Grinder and it was made for gay men to sodomize each other. That's two. That's two different apps. No. Isn't it? <laughs> wow. Did we get, you know what dick dingers are? Oh. No. It's when they spend drugs off each other's red penises. And it just been in buns. Is this Dean? What is that called? Dick bingers. How good is God? <laughs> dick bingers. Second question. Has anyone seen, well, where is my beautiful girlfriend, Virginia? There she is. Jenny, come off here. Come on. I still remember, like it was yesterday, the day that the Lord gave you to me. And he said, Glenn, this is your blank canvas. It is pale. It is colorless. Oh, oh, I want she... you to give it life, to give it color. You fuck that. I said to the Lord, I will give it everything except for one thing. One <laughs> question? One? Mm -hmm. Dick. Vaginal intercourse! <laughs> <laughs> what the actual fuck is this place? You want some strawberry lemonade? I haven't seen this sort of fucking bedlam since we fired Roman candles at coyotes that night and caught one right in the butthole. Fuck. <laughs> Ran up the back porch, dropped seven shades of shit, and dad's work. Hey, so Ben Wolf, they're both in the back bush. There's for sure mooses. Hey, dark. I know, dark. A dark. <laughs> They're all so innocent. Fucking grinder. Grinder? Grinder! Uh, what? Pray tell you don't grind away. What are you skids doing out of your parents' basement, Stuart? Oh, yeah. these are the skids. Rana would be hanging out with the skids at a bass nectar concert. I would not! Come on! <laughs> Trying to take their twenty percent off the meth intake, boys. Get my daughter Mary, you running ass? Oh, games full of subliminal messages. I'm gonna stop someone at a field day. Chuck Bukowski. Oh yeah, Chuck Bukowski. This is that's a better one, Stuart. Get that line on the face. Stop, Gigi. Shut up! Why did you start with this one? Because in five hundred years, my basement resembles an island Xanadu in comparison. Okay. After a quick math tells me this time, however, you've been so agonized by a woman that you're now seeking the company of men. Oh, okay, we've all thought about it. I'm <laughs> Thank you for a pipe fitter, Wayne. <gasps> Five years of age, we figured you were a concrete slam slammer. Well, I drink from the very cup when the Cardinals are right there. Would it like chicken for any fellas? <laughs> oh my god, they're so annoying. Uh, doggy? Uh, backdoor bandit. I'm gay, but donut puncher? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, sure thing. Oklahoma. <laughs> Rear Admiral. Uphill Gardener. <laughs> Boom bumper. This is awkward for me, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> These guys must stink. Oh, I want to get one of these dick reduce for real. Oh, stop it! You know I love rip and ditch. <laughs> rip and ditch. Look at his hands. His posture. I'm dying. Come gutters. <laughs> Fucking come gutters. You don't change your attitude, you're gonna lose out on all the girls. Like the 12 year olds or the 13 year olds. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. I mean, that's all we're gonna do to you. It's surprised to see you here. I mean, I didn't realize you were a big fan of the ditch. Oh, more of a ditch we don't. <laughs> Than a ditch. I can tell this show's a little bit lower budget because the, the audio is not as super clean sometimes when they're far away. What are you doing with the bird tile, Wayne? Didn't we just catch you cruising right here? Come again? Hey, Chicky boys be watching Friday Night Lights with a gym sock on your joystick? Trip tip. You're in Cinema One Tree Hill, maybe some gossip girl. However, I think we got some bigger fish to fry right here. Looking for love over the rainbow now, are we? Mix in from One Tree Hill, some gossip girl. I fucking hate you too. However, fucking hate him more. And I just found out he's ambidextrous. Fuck let me snicker, what a series of unfortunate events you fucking did, you ugly fuck. Bull of our broken dreams. Fuck you, Stuart. Hey, fuck you, Stuart. 
I can't stop laughing. It's fucking this is hilarious. Small town shenanigans. It's so funny. It's the bar everybody goes to in the town. You must be having a fun night. Er, bro is gay. LMFAO in all caps from Riley. Wait, you remember when you were 19? Those worm pickers kept coming in the night and trampling on our beans? What'd you do? Dog six foot holes, put a skunk in each one, and wait for him to fall in. Kids ate Daryl on his bike. What'd you do? Put stink bombs in the Nerf gun and fired it at him on prom night. Drinking and driving like ain't shit. Remember you came in from Hey, she's parked. It's Mario Kart drinking and driving rules. No, this is that way. I think a lot of people do. It's for the better. <laughs> oh Alexander! He's going in the trash. <laughs> what? Oh, God. Is it Chris who does that? Yep, 100%. Why are they calling him? He's a real dowdy. He's a real dandy. His new boyfriend guy. Yeah. Oh. Oh! What the hell are you doing? I'd ask you the same thing, you fucking tit. I'm taping an idiot. I'm not sneaking up on dudes and starting fights. I'm not fighting you, I'm smacking you. Well, that's right. You don't fight anymore, do you? I figured I'd have one on deck for sure after I stole your girl. Ooh. What? So what's it gonna take to get you back on the horse there, champ? Do I go inside and spread Angie right out on the bar when she gets here? I fucked your girl more times than you had a hot meal. Ooh. Maybe your sister wants to join us. It's Katie, right? I'm gonna go over there and ask you myself. Ooh. Ah! <laughs> you look like an action figure. <laughs> no, here we go. What is this? Woo! This is something. Woo! Damn. Damn. <laughs> Ah, right in the fist. It sound like there are pillows in that garbage. Oh my god! Letter Kenny. Go home, Daryl. <laughs> oh, these pussies ain't talking shit now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sing <laughs> Oh, my God. This is wild. This, this is, is like, wild. Dude, I wonder. Not stop also, the whole time. difficulty understanding anything that they were saying, and without subtitles, <coughs> I would be completely lost. If subtitles lost. weren't on, I would, yeah, no way. For sure. Some of those lines. I think they were specifically meant to be hard to catch if you're not like it's like uh, privy with the lingo. It reminds me of oh, like uh, the British God. movies with the super ridiculous <laughs> British slang. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You like I'm that? sure there are pockets of Canada that talk like this though. Oh, like, oh my through, God! Right? I want to watch the whole thing now. This is so funny. That was really funny. I just didn't understand the dick grabbing at the end, <laughs> but it's kind of funny. I mean, if you're gonna fight somebody, I don't know. It's a paralyze them by grabbing their dick. Yeah. I, it's a real disrespectful way to get uh, get your ass beat. What are you gonna say when people are like, "Oh man, you got beat up. What happened?" Like, well, uh, he, uh, he he grabbed me by my dick and then punched the fuck out of me and threw <laughs> me in the trash. Like, no one wants to say that. <laughs> very true. Yeah. Very true. That well, was, I was that guy so talking so much mad shit though. He like, was. It, it, it he looked, looked like discount Macklemore. Fuck him. Oh, Troy. <laughs> he was like a fancy Macklemore. Fancy Macklemore. So like I wonder what like Daryl did to like stop fighting and everything now get back into fighting. You know what I mean? Daryl is Daryl the other guy? Yeah, Daryl's the other guy. Friend. Yeah, so not I mean yeah, Daryl, sorry, Wayne, 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 yeah. Daryl's a friend, Daryl yeah. and then Wayne and Katie are brother and sister. Well he was saying that uh, Wayne's right ex girlfriend had got him to stop fighting. I mean, which you know is obviously for the good. But people oh, just yeah, kept fucking with him. End. So he had to uh you know, have to whoop a little bit more ass and be like, All right, <laughs> Episode two yeah. thumbnail is hilarious. Are you seeing this? No, so I turned off the TV. Aww. Now he's fighting again. So yeah. well, he's, he's, he's back out of the monkey's out of the cage, man. Monkey's out of the bottle. Andrew's gonna want him again now. Watch. Monkey's out of the bottle. What does that even mean? <laughs> Monkey doesn't go back in the bottle. Mean only the comes genie. Out. What are you talking? <laughs> <laughs> are you talking about like monkeys in a barrel? 
No, he's no, mixed like think, six think... metaphors. <laughs> <laughs> well, all I'm saying now that now James that Franco Wayne now that Wayne oh, is yeah. back into fighting and stuff, Angie's gonna want him again. Watch. I mean, uh, it wouldn't make sense because Angie is the one who convinced him to stop fighting. Like, oh, uh, she's gonna find it hot. Watch. Uh, real talk. Here's an honest question for anybody watching: Do uh, ladies find it I hot? I want to see Angie when the dudes is fighting all the time. Because I no. feel like every single guy at the bar that gets into a fight goes home and beats his meat. Like, yeah, <laughs> no, it's not hot. But it's like not. in TV shows, the bad boy is gonna be hot. He's it's only hot if you're protecting your girl. He is. You gotta, you gotta like protect your girl. Oh yeah, well, that's different yeah. though. I mean, I, you know, I'm dudes in the fucking clubs. You shut the fuck up. You shut the fuck up. They get into the huge fight and then. And, and then they leave, well, and like all the girls are still there. Like <laughs> the bros are my favorite part. Yeah. Would we part? take off our what? Your glasses and hat when you fight, or just your shirts? Fuck no. Like I'm, Jonesy and Riley. I don't take no, my no, shirt off. Glasses my gotta fight. stay on. The AirPods gotta stay on. So <laughs> stupid. <laughs> they are, they are literally my favorite part. <laughs> you gotta put Those more clothes guys? on. It makes yes. more sense for protection. <laughs> Because I they feel like at, at least I've like seen that type of person in real life. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I can like that that like that stereotype I can like relate to in yeah. a way. But like I, I don't think I've ever like really met any country boys in real life? Yeah. Oh. Huh. Ah, well, I guess I haven't been taking you around the right parts of Indiana. <laughs> oh god. I know people that look exactly like this Wayne guy. No. Like, yeah. Stiff neck, I love just like I straight love this action posture. Figure. Like the yeah. yeah, the um <laughs> like pointing to his like fucking crotch all the time, just like eh. Hey. Yeah, put your hands somewhere, you won't put them in your pockets. <laughs> but no, I know a, a couple of country motherfuckers like him too, man. Or even a couple of dudes I went to school with were genuinely like that because uh Ben Davis like gets a lot of country kids and a lot of city kids mm. too. So I mean, there, there were like a lot of nice. people like that in Waco, but I didn't really have like a lot of interaction with them. Yeah. Yeah. I have um Katie, I, have a I question. forgot you were in fucking Waco. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. I have a question not, for you guys. Not the actual incident. Yeah, whatever. On a scale of one to America, how free are you? <laughs> America. I'm a bald eagle holding a flag and a fucking bottle rocket, baby. <laughs> oh my god. That was a good line. I'm going to use that line on Nahid today. He's going to oh, love it. Nahid, yeah. Dude, so, one of Nahid's favorite things in the world is, like, America. So. The other thing that they uh, <laughs> said that I, I found interesting was, like, uh, they threw eggs at somebody who had a Confederate flag in the back of the truck. Well, the fuck does yeah, somebody in Canada have so a Confederate flag? That, <laughs> or is there a different Confederate flag in Canada for a different thing well, that people also don't like? Because, like, if it's good an American question. Confederate flag, like, you're so far north, you're out of America. The, yeah, I'm yeah. pretty sure that there, wasn't there a civil war in Canada? I don't fucking know. I have no idea Maybe. about Canadian history. Only thing I know so is that Justin Trudeau wore blackface flag. twice. And they also burned down the White it's House. It's your neighbor. Once. How do you not know that? That we know of. That we know of. They burned twice. down the White House once because why would we know Canadian history? Because they are neighbors. Yeah, uh, Marquetta, we don't get taught that in our schools here. No. We just we learn about America yeah. and, uh, and things about other countries. I, I think uh, we learned about Mexico, though. Conquistador. In Jordan, it's, it's and below the U.S. The serpent. In Jordan, we so learned about the, all the snake on the stick, and that's how they got the flag. I wish we'd learned about Canada. Yeah, Canada's just, just like been that awkward, like other brother we have that's kind of like us, but we don't know much about them. I always thought At Canada our, was nice. School system. Like everybody in Canada was nice, which I know is a silly thing to think, but this was like back in the day, <laughs> and I'd be playing on Xbox, and like you know, you just play on Xbox, and people always talking shit, and then I remember I met like for a week. A string of the most racist Canadians I have ever seen. It was like you guys are from the fucking south. We're like eat a dick in word. We're from the fucking Canada. And I was like, oh, oh god. god. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Canada's number one. Um, I mean, it's, you know, they produce a lot country. of goddamn yeah. superstars. Um, the honestly, church group I'll, thing was hilarious too. Uh, yeah, just like with, the way the dude, was, what did he say? He was ripping Didge. Ripping Didge. Was like, was that ripping guy Didge. reminds me of the Dean from Community. It's Dean Pelton for sure. <laughs> yeah, Aww. yeah, I can see that. Also, the I just, love I love the skid group the most though. There's like that that one guy just kept yelling. They were the most like, annoying. <laughs> 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 So that one you know, guy like, this is getting awkward for me. And like yeah. being like, I, I, I'm getting uncomfortable with this. <laughs> like, yeah, shut yeah, up, we support like, you, but we're, we're making fun of him. 
Uh, so the girl <laughs> in the Christian group was like, fucking sucked his finger and all that weird shit, like... Yeah, like, what, uh, what was that about? And also, I think the uh, the leader of the church group is, uh, he's very flamboyant, and he was like, I, God gave me this blank, pale canvas. I'm like, what the yeah. fuck are you talking about? Yeah, that was so... <laughs> I was those, like, those what do you mean? So many levels. I but I no like vaginal the guy in the Stop. <laughs> the guy in the bathroom who's like, he, he gave it gave the beaver eyes. Uh, the Bieber eyes. I the like Bieber the way you were doing it. It was so funny. <laughs> uh, this show, honestly, Bieber I want to commend the writing and like just like everything. Personally, like I love sitcoms. This is kind. Of, this is like yes. one of my kind of favorite uh, shows. Yeah. Like kind of like a TV genre, whatever you want to call it. This is my personal favorite. And I've always skipped on Hulu because I was like, I don't know what this is. But now I'm really mm-hmm. happy. I really, really want to continue this. This yeah. is so funny. Oh yeah, it's a cool comedy for sure. The show. Mm-hmm. Good writing, good yeah. jokes. Love it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, thanks for the uh, thanks for the request, Lauren. I enjoyed it. I kind of hope we get sure. to watch the rest of this. I, I hear it gets really funny because this show has actually been recommended to me multiple times by multiple different people. Nice. So okay. I'd be interested in seeing more of what it's all about. Just following yeah. Wayne and... What's the other dude's name? I don't know. Daryl. Wayne. <coughs> Wayne. Daryl. We got Wayne. Katie. Daryl. Wayne. Dan. Alexander. Angie. Troy. Riley. <laughs> yeah. Jonesy. 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 The whole crew. Fucking Jonesy. Jonesy. If I heard, yeah. Yeah, you're gonna have to convince me if your name's Jonesy that you're not an asshole. Want to meet one Jonesy that's <laughs> Jonesy. not an asshole? I don't know a single Jonesy. Jonesy. But hell yeah, guys. This has been awesome. You Thank are, you for the request, you, you guys. Keep in mind, we're not going to watch the show. We're just watching the request. It's a request. It's one of our Patreon tiers. And uh, we dug it. And I'm definitely literally going to probably watch episode two tonight. And nobody can stop me. Yeah. No! Unless... Oh. All right, bye! Bye! Thanks for watching this reaction request with the normies. Check us out on Patreon for early access and uncut content. Special shout out to our super patrons, Eleanor, Jesse, Joe, Lauren, Luis, Michael, Mike, Nick, Ruby, Dangerous, Nuptup, Quentin, Abdullah, Allison, Tristan, Diet Dan, Edward, Keyboard Junkie, the NYR fan, and ZJP. And we'll see you all next time.